We often see and hear from our users asking these questions. Why does TFP suggest such a low total alkalinity TA levels? Aren't these levels dangerous? Why in the world would we suggest such a high pH level? The answer and reasoning behind our levels is actually really very simple. To get there, there are two things we need you to understand. Firstly, a high TA resists a decrease in pH. Second, you need to note that chlorine pucks, which are very commonly used, are highly acidic and tend to lower the pH in pools. Putting these together, you'll see that the industry suggests a higher total alkalinity to help avoid crashing the pH of pools using pucks, which would cause damage. At TFP, we tend to avoid suggesting pucks and other granular forms of chlorine, so the issue of crashing the pH isn't as much of a concern. Instead, we suggest a much lower total alkalinity level to help users introduce less acid when lowering their pH as it rises. Both of our suggested forms of chlorination, salt water generators and liquid chlorine, tend to give users an increasing pH level over time. It's very common for a user to grow frustrated by the frequent acidic additions. To combat that, a user can lower their total alkalinity, thus slowing down the pH increases. We hope this helps explain why we suggest a lower total alkalinity level than many on the outside. As always, if you have any questions, please feel free to visit us at www.troublefreepool.com.